Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny- Stop! What the heck, Stacy? <laughs> Girl, look up! I just saved your life! They banned Christmas music! This is ridiculous. I was just starting to get into the Christmas spirit. Who is that? It's Mr. Smith. He's singing Jingle Bells. He has his AirPods in. Mr. Smith, stop! One horse open. No. Sweetheart, you got to smile. It's picture day. Come on. I don't feel like smiling. Well, you know what? At least take this brush and comb your hair a little before I take your picture, okay? Uh-oh. Not today. Ew! You got me right in the Sorry. eye! Hey, babe, what are you doing? Well, brushes are banned, so I figured I would try a fork. <laughs> what are you, the little mermaid? We have to break we up. We need to break up. No more Mr. Smith, no more boyfriend, but at least I still have you. Oh, no, they don't. Anyone with a dog has to hand it over to me. We have to hide you. Girls, meet the newest member of our organization. This is number 98. It's time for you to receive your mark. My mark? Mm-hmm. Every girl here has one. Scanning complete category. Red. What does that mean? You are one of the special ones. Now hold out your wrist. This is how that is the mark of the assassin, my dear. Now go get ready for training. Some assassin you are can't even take a punch. Looks like you knocked her unconscious. Great job, 98. Hey, what you did back there with 23? I kind of went too hard on her, didn't I? Actually, I thought that was pretty cool. I'm 52, by the way. I'm 98. Good work. This is your final test. You are to eliminate the subject. Bring it out. Your mark doesn't allow for any weaknesses. What are you waiting for, 98? Take the shot. Hi. What is our motto? No attachments, no weaknesses. That's right, and you've worked very hard to get here, so don't blow it. I can't. <laughs> Idiot! Show me your mark. That's the assassin's mark, not a coward. Now pick up your weapon. Prove to me you have what it takes. What are you- Hey, it's okay. I got you. Ugh. You chose that dog over me! 98? What's going on? I'm escaping this place. Come with me. Is that a dog? Yeah, I'm saving it. Come on, we have to go now. I can't. I have the mark of a technophile. I'm not as agile as you. I can't make it out of here. 52, that's not true. We can make it if we- Attention all girls. 98 has gone rogue. She must be stopped by any means necessary. I think I know a way you can escape. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I got the back gate open, but you gotta run fast. Okay. It's 98. Get her! Uh, hey, we made it. Oh, thank goodness. I'm really gonna miss... Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you need some help? Yes. I sort of ran away from home. Oh, darling. Uh, do you need somewhere to stay? Okay, well, it's not safe here for you and your little pup. Why don't you come with me? Come on, honey. Let me help you out. So, darling, what happened to you? Um, I'd rather not talk about it. That's okay. Oh, uh, I see. Wait, what's that on your wrist? Oh, it's just, uh, something I drew on myself. Darling, I prepared a bed for you and your little pup. You better get some rest. Thank you so much. I'm happy to help. Morning. Your little pup was looking for you. Do you want me to call your parents? No, I, I don't have parents. Oh, are you a foster child? I was. That mark on your wrist, does that have anything to do with where you came from? Darling, I want you to know that you can trust me, but if I'm going to let you stay in my house, I need to know more about you. Okay. And the next thing I know, I wake up and I can't remember my name. Instead, they gave me a number. 98. Oh, darling, that's awful. Listen, you can stay here as long as you like. Thank you. It's my pleasure. No child should have to go through that. Now, let me get you cleaned up, all right? Because that sure is a pretty bad cut you got there. All right, I'm going to go get you two some food. I'll be back. Hey, girl, calm down. 98. 52. Oh, my gosh, I can't believe I found you. I escaped. Hey, girl, relax. She's a friend. Listen, a nice lady let me stay here, and I'm pretty sure she'll let you stay here, too. Really? Where is she? Oh, she's at the store. Good. I mean, good for you, 98. I'm glad you found help. Wait, what was that? 
What? That sound. Do it now. I don't know what you're talking about. Are you on comms with the director? Uh, you weren't supposed to hear that. <laughs> Stay back. <laughs> Shut up. Go get help. No, hey, get back here. <sighs> Sorry, 98. Yes, ma'am. I'm, I'm bringing her now. She's more skilled than I thought. We just need to make her more compliant. You must comply. No, no. You will comply. You must. Okay, I think that's enough time. Now, tell me your mission, 98. To eliminate the dog. And what else? And get rid of the woman who took me in. I'm glad you understand, because there's no room for air. So you're going to do exactly what I say. Anything I touch turns to money, or any doll I touch comes to life. I'm too little to have money, and I don't have any friends in foster care, so I pick this one. I pick this Barbie to come to life. Whoa. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. Are you gonna be my friend? Of course, I can be anything you want me to be. You can brush my hair and take me anywhere. Cool. You can also customize me using this remote. I want to give you brown eyes like me. Oh, Claire, who are you talking to? Uh-oh, who's that? That's another foster girl that lives here, and she's really mean to dolls. We have to hide you. Come on. Claire, who are you talking to? Nobody. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. What the? Barbie, I told you to hide. Sorry, Claire. I just love making new friends. Does this control her? Hey, give that back. Ugh, just let me see it. Stop! You're gonna break her! Ugh, you're so annoying. This is why no one wants to adopt you. I don't want your dumb remote anyways. You killed her! <laughs> Have fun with your dead Barbie. Barbie, please wake up. Hola! Soy Barbie. ¿Cómo estás? Uh-oh, I think she reset you onto Spanish mode. That is mi mejor amiga. Barbie, I can't understand you. What am I gonna do? Barbie, I can use my powers to bring Ken to life to help us. I hope you know how to bring Barbie off of Spanish mode. Hey, Barbie. Hola, Ken. Why is she speaking Spanish? That's why I brought you here, Ken. I don't know how to make her speak English. Can I see her remote? Sure. That should do it. Hey, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Want to go for a drive? Sure, Ken. Activate the Barbie car. We cannot tell anyone that you're dolls. What do we say if they ask us? Tell them that, that you're my parents. Okay. Shh, we have to be really quiet so we can sneak out of here. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire! Claire. How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted? That's right, and one of her mother's many jobs is being a police officer. So if you don't leave right now, we're going to have you arrested. No, no, sorry, forget about the money. Bye! Claire! Are you okay? My arm got a little cut. Press the top button on the remote. Okay. Dr. Barbie is here to help. You're so strong, Claire. You should be feeling much better now. Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well... I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Claire, wait. I understand if you don't want to because I know I'm not that great. What? Why would you think that? Because I'm not as smart or as cute as the other kids. I think that's why nobody wants to adopt me. Oh, Claire. Don't think like that. You're so smart. And you're super cute. Do you really think so? Claire, you can do anything you put your mind to. And anyone who tells you otherwise doesn't know what they're talking about. We would be honored to be your parents because you're such a good girl. Right, Ken? That's right, Barbie. Really? Yeah. Being a dad sounds fun. Guys, I forgot I had this in my pocket. My puppy. Since we're a family now, do we want to have a pet? Absolutely. Aww. Aww. This is going to be so much fun. I'll start looking for Barbie houses for us to live in. I'm so happy for us. We're going to be a great family. Yeah, Barbie and Ken finally together at last. Ugh. Ow, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? Ugh, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? I... I don't know. 
All of a sudden, we just feel really strange. My powers, they're running out. Oh no. All of you are gonna turn back into dolls. How much time do we have left? One minute. Please don't leave me. Claire, we'll never leave you. We might not be able to be your parents, but we'll always be your dolls. Yes, and you're going to get adopted. Do you promise? We promise. I'm gonna miss you so much. We'll still be together. You can take us wherever you go. Barbie, our eyes. They're melting. You guys are crying. Oh, the time's up. You guys are gonna... We love you. See you on the other side. If it isn't the little tattletale, where are your parents now, huh? They're right... They're at home. So you better not try anything or I'm gonna tell on you. No, no, I was just wondering. <laughs> I was looking for you all day. I'm sorry, I was just... I didn't want to hear it. You're lucky someone wants to adopt you. What? I'm getting adopted? Yes, finally. You guys were right. What? Who was right? Nothing. Meet your new parents. Hi. Hey. Can I bring my dolls? Oh, honey, of course. We'll consider them a part of our family. Wanna play mother, may I, for a chance to win 50 million? I always wanted a mother, and I can use the money to buy myself my own house one day. Hello. Hi. Are you really my mother now? Yes, I am your mother. You listen to me. Okay. Mother, may I have this cookie? No, you may not. But... Do not argue with me. It is past your bedtime. Mother, may you sing me a bedtime song? I'm tired, but I can't sleep. No. <laughs> Hush, little baby. Don't say a word. Mother's going to buy you a mockingbird. Thank you, Mother. You're the best mother I ever had. Hey, Mother, I was just thinking, may I know what happens if I don't listen to you? No, you may not. Well, Mother, may I go to school? Yes, you may. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Mother, may I go see a friend? Yes, you may. Hey, what's wrong? Remember the bully I had since elementary school? Yeah. She was eliminated from the game today. And I'm pretty sure that Mother wants me to win this game. You think Mother wants you to win the 50 million? Yes. Look, I get you were a foster kid and Mother is the closest thing you've had to a real mom. But she's AI. She doesn't have feelings. No, listen to me. I am telling you, I am pretty sure that I am her favorite. Okay, let's test this then. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? No, no. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? Yes, you may. What? Forget Mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Mess around and find out. I have to shut down Mother. I have to shut down Mother. Mother, may I please have some water? No. You haven't let me drink water for three days. Mother, may I please give her some of my water? No. You may not. I can't take this anymore. Give me the water. Please, if you just hold on a little bit longer, I'm gonna... <sighs> save you. Mother, may I ask you a question? Yes. How many players are left in this game? There are three players left. Mother, may I go to sleep? Of course. But wait, I'm always watching. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Good night. It's time for me to end this game once and for all. Stop. You didn't ask me permission to come here. I'm sorry, Mother. I can't let this game go on anymore. Don't. If you unplug that, I will have you eliminated. No, you won't, because I know you care about me. If you were going to kill me, you would have done it already. I have to do this. Wait. I can show you. Your real mother. I'm sorry, I have to shut you off. Wait. I can show you. Your real mother. You can? Yes. She's closer than you think. Your real mother is- Shut her off! Mother powering me down. Finally, the game's over. Jocelyn? Forget mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Surprise, I survived. I'm glad you're okay, but she was right about to tell me who my real mother was. 
I'm sorry, but she had to be shut down. Do you feel like this was a little too easy? Wouldn't you think there would be security? Yeah, that is odd. Forget about it. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, Mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of Mother. But I'm also... Your real mother. No. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of mother. But I'm also... Your real mother. No. I'm so sorry. I had to put you up for adoption so I could run this game. But now it's over. You hurt so many people. I never meant for this game to get so brutal. I started out by doing this as a science experiment. But it made me lose sight of the things that really matter. Even as mother, I was watching over you. I wanted you to win that 50 million. But don't worry. Because I'm going to make a new game. What? Yes, and I was thinking, instead of Mother May I, we could all play Red Light, Green Light. And since you're my daughter, you'll have to play- Happy birthday, we got you something! I think I know what it is. An iPhone 4 Hello, toy Lord pencils. pencils! Really? Honey, they're magic pencils! Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco giving her a lecture about listening. Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. I'm just a baby. Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still have to say okay, mom. I'm just a baby. I think today I'm going to go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? How did you find out? Never mind that, but why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about, like, uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No, why? Because I think I'm sitting next to one. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? What are you doing with my stuff? Well, I think the better question is, what are you doing with this? That's for my lunch. It's strawberry jam. Oh! <laughs> Can I have my stuff back? Yeah, sorry. Yesterday's power was kind of a disaster, so today I think I'm gonna go with green. Green power unlocked. Let's hope this power helps me figure out if that guy is a vampire or not. Hey, so I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. You're good. I actually think you're kind of cute. <laughs> How old did you say you were again? 17. I'm throwing a party tonight. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. I would love that. Sweet. I'll airdrop you my address. Hey, you made it. Yeah, but where is everyone? They're on their way. Hey, Mom, this is the girl I was telling you about. Ooh, she looks beautifully delicious. Stop it. Really, I could just eat you. Oh, no. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait. I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencil's power? I have to. Wish mode activated. There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you could understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. 
How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils, and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great vampire. <gasps> 10,000? But mommy and daddy always give me 15,000. They must be trying to put me on a budget or something. My parents only gave me five dollars today. Yikes, sucks for you. Please, can you buy me my lunch? No, I don't think I will. Oh, please, I'm so hungry. Sorry, I can't help you. You know what? You're gonna regret this. Okay, your total's eight thousand. Oh, I don't quite have enough. <laughs> Do you want me to just put it on hold for you? No, I really wanted to get this bag today. Um, my parents are going to reload my balance tomorrow. Is it okay if I just pay for it then? Yeah, sure. We can do that for you, babe. Mm. Thank you. Five dollars? No, this, this has to be an error or something. If you don't have the money, you have to return the bag. Well, about that, I kind of sort of already gave it away as a birthday present. Okay, then you're getting arrested. Security? Wait, what? Officer, there's been a mistake. I have a lot of money. Yeah, sure. Just sign right here, okay? I am not signing anything until I speak to my lawyer. Oh, really? Yes, and I know that I get one phone call. What, you gonna call mommy and daddy to come save you? Maybe. You're something else, kid. Come on, follow me. <sighs> Hello? Mommy, it's me. Make it quick, darling. I'm at a photo shoot. Mommy, I've been arrested. What? Yes, why did you and Daddy only give me five dollars today? Five dollars? No, Daddy and I sent you 15k. What? Then I don't know what happened, but can you guys come get me? I'm in France right now, darling. Okay, then what about Daddy? Daddy is shooting a movie in Dubai. Well, then what am I supposed to do? Joanna, we need you. Darling, I'll call you back. Hello? Hey, you got a visitor. Mommy and Daddy finally came to get me. Hi, remember me? I told you you'd regret not buying me that lunch. You switched our bank accounts, didn't you? Mm-hmm. I learned how to hack the system. It's something I've been working on for a very long time. All of this because I wouldn't buy you a stupid lunch? Not just that. You're a spoiled little brat who needed to be taught a lesson. You don't know me. Oh, but I do. I did my research on you. Your mommy is a model and your daddy is a movie star. But they both love their careers more than you. That isn't true. Oh, really? Then why aren't they here? Give me back my money. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, thanks? <laughs> Just kidding. Hey, you little- Watch it. If you want to get out of here, you're going to do exactly as I say. Now that you're out, for every task you do for me, I'll give you back five dollars. But that'll take forever. Exactly. Go clean my bathroom. Yeah, no way. All right, then. I guess I'm never switching our bank accounts back. Okay, fine. That's what I thought. Now get to scrubbing. Okay, I'm all done. Good. Here you go. It's kind of hot in here, so fan me with this. Who do you think you are? Royalty or something? <laughs> Might as well be. Now do it. Can I stop now? Hey, what was that about? No complaining or you lose money. All right, you know what? That's it. Ugh. No, stop! Darling, I'm so proud of you for getting your money back. Yeah, but I realize I should be a little bit more generous with my money, since you guys do give me so much. Darling, your daddy's movie got cancelled, so we're gonna have to cut back. Oh, well then, um, how much am I gonna get now? Well, you see... Layla, where are you? You're supposed to be my backup. Layla! She just put in the chat that she's out of speaking time. And we just lost. Your mother requests to see you. Guys, I gotta head off. See you later, rich girl. Must be nice to have a butler. Shut up. Tell her I'll be right there. Bye. Darling, meet my new boyfriend. What's up? Mom, can I speak to you alone for a minute? Okay, I'll be right back, babe. Mom, he is like 25. You realize that you're 40 now, right? So? Age is just a number and he makes me happy. Don't you want me to be happy? Yeah, man, she's hot and loaded. Nah, she doesn't even know about my secret. Dude, her daughter's kind of hot, too. I'm just in this for the money, though. Shit, you scared me. Wait, how long have you been standing out here? Hey, hold on. Mom, your boyfriend is a... Aw, you're out of speaking time, honey. I thought you had an hour left. Guess there was a glitch. Honey, enough charades. I don't understand. Well, that was weird. <gasps> 
Young lady, what is wrong with you? I'm so sorry, babe. Go to your room. You seem stressed. Here, take your squishy. You know, you could use your phone to communicate. She's not picking up? They did leave saying they wanted alone time. Ah, yes, oh, he is so busted. Mom, there's something I need... I have to take a phone call, excuse me. Don't worry, I'll keep her company. You stay out of my way. This is your final warning. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Her boyfriend's controlling your speaking time? Yeah, I mean, it's the only thing that makes sense. <clears throat> the boyfriend has left. Time for me to expose him. Hi, Mom. I see your boyfriend isn't around. He went to go get me coffee. Isn't that sweet? No, actually not sweet, because he has a big secret, and one of them is that he's been stealing my speaking time. Hey, I'm back. No, watch, Mom. My speaking time is just going to magically disappear now. What? Seems fine to me, honey. Okay, fine. If I still have my voice, then I'm going to use it. I heard you saying that you had a secret. A secret? Oh, boy. I wanted this to be a surprise, but oh, well. Evelyn, will you make me the happiest man alive and marry me? Babe, yes! <laughs> I cannot let her marry him. Hey, what is this? This is how he's been controlling my speaking time. Give me that! I warned you! Come here! Plan to expose me didn't work. Your mom and I are gonna get married today in Las Vegas. Babe, where are you? Coming, sweetheart. Sadie, there you are. I had a feeling you might be in need of some help. There we go. Are you quite all right, Miss Sadie? Here you are. I took this off of Mr. Blake. Shall I get us a cab for Las Vegas? Oh, yeah. I now pronounce you husband. Stop the wedding. Your fiancé, Blake, is a psychotic little gold digger. Babe, I thought she was sick. No, Mom. He locked me in my makeup room. What? She's lying. I saw her myself, and he's also been stealing her speaking time. I have not. How could he do that? With this. Hey! You give that back, you little... I think you've said enough. You jerk! That's for messing with my daughter. Ugh. And that's for taking my speaking time. Air? Wait, does this mean I'm not getting superpowers? Hi, honey. Oh, hi. So, did you get your power? Uh... Oh, I bet you got invisibility like me. No, I bet she got my super strength. Right, sweetheart? Guys, I actually need to get to class, so I'll talk to you later, okay? Class, line up in the gym for your power assessment. <sighs> I'm so done for. Okay, state your name and your power. Sarah Steelman and my power... Hold on. You're Steelman's kid? Yeah. It is a pleasure to meet you. I am a big fan of your parents. Bet you got an awesome power. Actually, my power hasn't exactly come in yet. <laughs> You're 18. That's impossible. I know, but it says air. That, my dear, is not normal. I'm going to send you to the nurse to have you looked at. Everything looks fine. Maybe you're just a late bloomer. Wait, it's loading again. An infinity symbol? What is that I've mean? never seen a symbol like that. It's me. Mom? I knew you'd remember. Don't listen to her. Listen to me. Stop! That's enough. <laughs> Are you guys sure I didn't hurt you? Yes, honey, we were more worried about you. I'm fine, but the teachers, Cal captured all of them. We have to save them. Do you know where they are? I think so. Come on. Thank you so much for saving us. Are you sure everyone's okay? We're all right, but the kids that did this to us are still out there. Wait, guys, Cal, we shouldn't have just left him knocked out. You're right. You shouldn't have. Don't look at his eyes. Sarah, I know you want to look at me. Look at me now. You want to listen. No! Say laser vision. Laser vision. <laughs> now take them out. Sarah, don't. Honey, you know us. We're your parents. You would never do this. Do it now, Sarah. No, I am done listening to you. Freeze breath. <laughs> Not so tough when you're frozen solid, now are you? Cal, Gabby, and their voice-stealing friend have all been locked up. Glad to hear that. Honey, I'm so proud of you. Well, you shouldn't be, because I'm a literal idiot. What? Sarah, why would you say that? I had a bad feeling about Cal since the beginning, but I just ignored it because I wanted a guy to like me. But of course, he was just using me the whole time. 
Oh, sweetheart, you're young. You're gonna make mistakes. But you're right. You should have been more careful. But what's important is that you fixed your mistake, which shows us that you're on your way to becoming a real hero. So we got you something. Surprise! My own super suit? Yep, for after you graduate. Aw, thanks, guys. Now we just gotta think of a name for you. Hmm, how about Infinity Girl? Oh, I like that! But remember, Sarah, with great power comes great responsibility. Dad, you stole that from Spider-Man. I know, but it's such a good quote. <laughs> this isn't over, Sarah. Mom! What? Where's my super suit? What? Where is my super suit? Oh, I, uh, put it away. Where? Why do you need to know? I need it. People are literally in danger right now. Your college application is in danger. It's due tomorrow and you haven't even started. Mom, I already told you I don't want to go to Super 10 University. Now if you'll excuse me. Sarah? Super speed. <laughs> Hurry up and give us the money. Not so fast. Hey, we got company. Who the hell are you? I would be Infinity Girl, and you two are about to be knocked out. Get her! Force field. I'm all out! Me too. Telekinesis. Uh, oh. Hey, put us down! Okay, whatever you say. <coughs> Good, you're back. We need you to babysit. Oh no, I can't. Yes, you need bonding time with your new baby sister. Looks like it's just you and me, Safina. <laughs> What the? She was just right here. Where did she? <laughs> How are you? <laughs> oh my gosh, are you okay? How did you even do that? People aren't supposed to get their powers until they're 18. Are you sure she did that? Yes, and she'll probably do it again. Just give her a second. Well, she's asleep right now, but I'll wake her up and- Oh no, you don't. I think you need some rest. Why don't you hand your baby sister over to me? Where are you off to? To a fire on Hero Drive. Some people might be trapped in a building. Oh, do you want us to come with you? Nah, guys, I think I'm good. My freeze breath should have that fire out in no time. Teleportation. <laughs> Look who's back. Are you okay? Yeah, I was able to save everyone, but I got a little burned in the process. Oh, honey, let me see it. Ow, mom, what are you- Hey, Sarah. Long time no see. <laughs> Cute baby sister you got here. You put her down right now. No, I don't think I will. What did you do to me? You'll see soon enough. Mom, Dad, stop him. He's gonna take Safina. Your family is under my control. Go to sleep, Safina. Here's the teleportation device. Dad! Thanks, Mr. Steelman. Of course. Super strength. What? <laughs> Bye, Sarah. No! We have to find her. There's no telling what he'll do to her. We will. Sarah, are your powers working? Shapeshifting. Nope. Whatever weapon he hit me with must have taken my powers. We're going to get your powers back, but first we have to find Safina. You're right, let's go. No way. You can't come without powers. But guys, I can still fight. No, not as well as your mom and I, and I am not letting anything happen to you too. They're gonna need my help, I just know it. <laughs> Safina? Hello. Hey, kid. Hey, coach. Did you get that power yet? Yeah, I I did. Ah, I knew you'd get it. What is it? Well, that's the thing. I don't exactly know what my power means yet, and uh, neither did the nurse. Aw, oh, kid, I hate to do this to you, but until you figure out what your power is, I'm putting you with the sidekicks. Sidekicks? No, no, my parents will Hey, sorry, Steelman, it's not my rule. Hey, sidekick, nice drink. Mind if I have some? Hey, Gabby, knock it off. No powers outside of class. Aw, is someone upset because they don't have a power? I do too have a power, I just don't know what it means yet. Right, you just keep telling yourself that. <sighs> I really need to find out what this symbol means. Why couldn't I have just gotten super strength or something? Hey, give me your money. Hey, I said give me your money. Get over the money. Why don't you come take it from me? Aw, that's cute. You really think you can- Aw, oh, I think it broke my jaw. <laughs> How did I just do that? This is so weird. Wait, do I get any power I want just by saying it out loud? Okay, let's test this theory. X-ray vision. <laughs> Hi, honey. We got you a gift for your 18th birthday. You guys got me a Gucci bag? Yeah. How'd you know that, sweetheart? It's in a package. Well, there's something I need to tell you. So your symbol means you have infinite powers? Yes. Coach, watch this. Think of a color. Mind reading. <laughs> 
You're thinking of blue. Yeah, that's amazing. Can you think of any power and then you get it? Well, I have to actually say it out loud, but yeah. Well, Stillman, I'm impressed. I'm putting you with the heroes. Yes, thank you. It's my pleasure, Steelman, but be careful. With a power like that, people are going to be very jealous. Are you sure? Yes, she's the one. We are so proud of you for getting put in the hero class. You guys have to go, huh? Yeah, sorry, sweetheart. There's a robbery three blocks down. Wait, can I come? No, honey. You can't legally fight crime until you graduate. That's right. Oh, come on. I can help you guys. I know, just not yet. Sup, Steelman. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Telekinesis. Ah! You little. <laughs> That's it. Come here. Freeze breath. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> You're OP, Steelman. This isn't fair. Class, open your books to page 104. We'll be learning how to outsmart a villain. Hey, mind if I share the book with you? Yeah, sure. Thanks. I'm new, so... Wait a minute. Aren't you Steelman's kid? Uh, yeah. For real? Damn, your parents are so cool. So I've been told. <laughs> hey, would you, uh, want to maybe hang out sometime? You are not going on that date. Dad, honey, let her live a little. He could be a supervillain for all we know. He's not a supervillain. He's in my class. What's his name? Cal. And his last name? I didn't ask his last name. Dad, come on, you're gonna make me late. Babe. Fine, but I want you back by eight. Okay, I will. Thanks. I am not gonna be late to this date. Super speed. Hey. Hey, trying out that super speed, I see. <laughs> so you're invincible, huh? Not exactly. Each power I say only lasts for 20 minutes, then I go back to normal. What would happen if you couldn't talk? What do you mean? Like if someone covered your mouth or uh, you lost your voice. Well, then I guess I'd be stuck as normal, but why do you ask that? Oh, no, I was just wondering. Anyways, uh, you know, prom's coming up. Would you maybe want to go together? Oh, I don't think my parents would. Let you? Come on, Sarah, you're 18. Hey, maybe if I introduce myself to them, they'll be okay with it. So, Cal, tell me, what's your power? Oh, Mr. Steelman, my power is kind of lame. Oh, come on, what is it? I can glow in the dark. Wow. So you're a sidekick, huh? Dad. <laughs> it's okay. Yes, sir, I am. Actually, I like that power. It's very... Safe. I won't have to worry about you, Cal. <laughs> I think my parents kind of warmed up to you. Yeah, that was a relief. So, I'll pick you up at 8 for prom then? Okay. Yeah. You look beautiful, sweetheart. Gorgeous. Oh, thanks, guys. But we want you to take this. Here. A uh, bracelet? Emergency locator. If anything goes wrong, you press that and we'll be there. <sighs> Thanks. Ready to go? Yeah, I think... Wait, I forgot my purse. Hold on, let me go super speed up there and then I'll go... No! Don't use your powers right now, okay? Excuse me? Why don't you want me using my powers? I just thought that we could be normal for a little bit, but I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you like that. Go ahead and get your purse. It's okay. I I don't even need my purse, actually. Let's just go. I'm gonna go get us some punch. Oh, okay. Sarah, have you seen the teachers? No, why? They're supposed to be here, but I can't find any of them. They're probably just running late. Sarah, come here. I want to show you something. Wait, where are we going? I want to take you somewhere private. Oh. Wait, did you hear that? No, what? Never mind. Come on, I know a nice spot for us. Are you cold? Maybe just a little bit. Aw, here, take my jacket. Oh, actually, no need. Flame hands. <laughs> Sarah, baby, remember I told you not to use your powers? Sorry, I just thought that- Shh. Do you remember what I told you my power was? Yeah, you said you had the power to glow in the dark. <laughs> I lied. You lied to me about your power? Of course. Did you really think I was a sidekick? Oh, well, yeah. Wow, you are so gullible. That's it. I'm getting my parents. <laughs> Are you looking for this? <laughs> Hi, Sarah. Hey, babe. Babe, you two are dating? Gabby, do it now. With pleasure. Mm. I can't hold her like that for mm. long. Where's your friend, Gabby? She's supposed to be here. Mm. <sighs> Relax, I'm here. Cal, what is going on? Do it! Super! That's your voice. Don't try to talk, Sarah. Just look at me. Nighty night, Sarah. <laughs> Oh good, you're awake. Don't be scared, Sarah. It's just a mask. It's me, Cal. Now it's time for me to get revenge on your parents. Give her her voice back. She's ready. 
Aren't you going to eliminate her parents? Then all the teachers. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. You're back early. Where's Cal? Oh, he's right there. Hey, Mr. Snowman. Cal, what's going on? I'm getting my revenge. Don't you recognize this mask? It was my father's before you killed him. Now, Sarah, tell him what you're going to do. I'm going to eliminate both of you. Honey, he must have mind-controlled her. Telekinesis. <laughs> Sarah, put that down. Ugh. Sarah, stop it. She only listens to me now. Oh, Mom, where'd you go? Sarah, listen to me. You are stronger than this. Teleportation. <laughs> Wait! Mom, where are you? I thought I heard you over here. Blame him. There's no sense in hiding. Found you. <laughs> Just show yourself and this all can stop. Listen to me. You know me. Learn a fact about every item you touch or forget a memory every time you see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at what? It's probably so expensive. Hey, mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for being eaten by a shark? It's not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational, dude. You from your mom. Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out. Transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's go. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? And Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Learn a fact about every item you touch or forget a memory every time you see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at what? It's probably so expensive. Hey, mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for being eaten by a shark? It's not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational. Do you from your mom? Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out. Transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's go. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? And Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Learn a fact about every item you touch or forget a memory every time you see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at what? It's probably so expensive. Hey, mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for being eaten by a shark? It's not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational. Do you from your mom? Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out. Transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's go. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? And Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Learn a fact about every item you touch or forget a memory every time you see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at what? It's probably so expensive. Hey, Mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for being eaten by a shark? It's not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational. Do you from your mom? Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out. Transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's go. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? And Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Learn a fact about every item you touch or forget a memory every time you see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at what? It's probably so expensive. Hey, mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for being eaten by a shark? It's not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational. Do you from your mom? Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out. Transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's go. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? And Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Blair, what's on your face? I don't know. Come here. We have to cover this up right now. But why? Because it, um, it makes you look ugly. Stay here. I'm gonna go buy some makeup. Bye, Dad. I'm going to school. Not so fast. Let's see your face. Seriously? Fine, you caught me. I ran out of concealer. And whose fault is that? Dad, you know today is my birthday, and my friend bought me this cupcake. You have to cover up that mark with concealer. Can't you just buy me some? No, I have to go to work, so you're gonna stay home. Happy birthday to me. This is ridiculous. I'm going to school. People can make fun of this mark all they want. Girl, you're late. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, your mark. I know, it's ugly, just ignore it. No, Blair, that's the mark of the lost princess. 
for the lost princess. What? <laughs> yeah, only the royals have that mark. Oh, I see what's going on here. What? You're making fun of me. I am not. I'm being serious. Save it. My dad said people would act weird when I showed them this mark. But I just didn't expect it from you. Blair, you could be in danger. Let go of me. I'm going home. You went to school? Yeah, you were right, okay? My friend made fun of my mark and started saying that I was some sort of lost princess. Lost princess, huh? Ridiculous, I know. I hope you learned your... This is the royal gods. Open the door. Go cover up your mark. But... Now, Blair, and quickly. They want to take you away. That's my daughter. See? No mark. Mm-hmm. I'm not so sure that's true. We found some makeup over here. Well, that's not Blair's because she doesn't wear makeup. Really? Well, we'll see about that. Just as I suspected, she's the princess. No, I'm not. Why are they saying that? They're lying to you, Blair. They just want to take you away from me. The only one lying is him. He is not your real father. He stole you from the kingdom. He had no reason to take me. Hmm, I guess he never told you. About what? Nothing. You have powers. Powers? Yes, all the royals do. That heart symbolizes your power to heal. I'm sure your father has used it. I covered up my mark. Good, honey. Oh. Are you okay? I will be. Just give me your hand. See, you always make me feel better. This whole time, you were using me. Of course not. Don't listen to them. I don't feel so good. Arrest him. Don't get a step closer to me, or else I'll kill her. Nobody move or I kill her. We need to cover up your mark. Nobody follows us, understand? Yes, sir, we understand. Perfect. No one can tell you're the princess now. <sighs> Time to go. You can reverse your powers. All you have to do is say it. Ow! No whispering. We're leaving. You royal guards will never find us again. Reverse my powers. Oh, Blair, what are you doing? Royals' powers can heal, but they can also kill. <gasps> And this is why you don't mess with the royals. Help the princess. Yes, ma'am. Feeling better, princess? Yes, thank you. Good, because there are some people who would like to see you. Hey, they have the same mark as... me. I can't believe it. It's you. It is my pleasure to inform you that my daughter, your princess, has returned.